In this video, we're reviewing the Hello sample from the Code Sample Library that comes with Abby's Fine Reader Engine Distribution Pack. This sample shows all the steps you'll need to perform to process your documents. It's possible to run this sample directly from the library, and you can see the Run Sample button here, but we'll review the sample source code first. So, let's load the sample code and take a look. This sample is nicely commented, making it easy to work with. The procedure uses the basic objects and methods of Abbey Fine Reader Engine to process an image file. First, we need to load the Abbey Fine Reader Engine. To do this, we need to load the Fine Reader Engine DLL. Next, we'll create the engine object using the Get Engine Object function. There are two more ways to load the engine object. Each of the loading methods has its own specifics. You can either load the engine object into a current process or load the engine object into a separate process. This way of loading the engine object is used in the engines pool sample, which can be found within the code sample library as well. You can find more details in the developer's help under the chapter titled Different Ways to Load the Engine Object. Now let's return to our project. As you can see, we've loaded the engine and we're ready to process with the Abbey Fine Reader engine. For this, we'll call the process with engine function, which includes two steps the setup engine parameters, and processing the sample image. We'll talk about each of these two steps in more detail, and we'll start with setting up the engine. The setup engine function loads the predefined profile for your scenario using the load predefined profile method of the engine object. There are 14 predefined profiles in Fine Reader Engine 11. The settings provided in these profiles are most suited for corresponding scenarios such as document conversion, document archiving, text extraction, and others. A detailed description of each profile can be found in the developer's help inside the Working with Profiles chapter. Let's return to our project. Now we'll use the Document Conversion Accuracy profile to convert a TIFF file into a rich text format file. Next, we'll move on to the Process Image function. We'll set up a path to the image we need to process. Then you'll see a comment. Don't recognize PDF file with a textual content. Just copy it. This means that the Fine Reader Engine, which is optional for PDF files only, can check for a text layer in the image file. It does this by using the isPDF with textual content method of the engine object. If a text layer exists, you can copy the file without recognition, speeding up the processing. However, note that the text layer may be irrelevant. Our next step will be to create the Fine Reader document object. Then we'll add image files to the created object. Next, we move on to the document recognition. For this, we'll call the process method of the Fine Reader document object. As an option, if you need to set up any additional processing parameters, you'll need to create the document processing parameters object and set the parameters for analysis, recognition, and synthesis. As you can see, this document processing parameter is passed as an input parameter to the process method. In our case, we'll use the default setting, which means we'll use the parameters in the predefined profile. Then, after recognition, we're ready to save our recognition results. We'll call the export method of the Fine Reader Engine Document object to save the document into a file of our specified format. In our case, it'll be a rich text format file. You can also create an export parameter object of the type you need, and you can set the export parameters as you like. We can also save results to PDF using Balanced Scenario, which you can see here. This means that the PDF export will be balanced between the quality of the file, its size, and the processing time. Now we're ready to close the Fine Reader document object. And our final step is to unload Fine Reader Engine. Now let's build and run this sample. You can see we're initializing the engine and loading the image. Next, we're recognizing the image. After that, we'll save recognition results and upload the image. Now let's compare our original image to what we have after processing. As you can see, they both look identical. So we processed all pages of the document as a logical unit and reconstructed the original layout of the document. We hope you enjoy working with the Abbey Fine Reader Engine. And for more information, please contact us today.